Hello everyone, it's Demo27. Like I said before, this is going to be a very long uh, playthrough since I can't save the game. So here we go. I also apologize for the somewhat sloppier gameplay. Usually I try to be very efficient and cut out uh, most, of the fill, most of the filler, but in a game like this where we cannot save, uh, kind of have to. Alright, here we are in Dreadal Vin. Uh, let's see, there's a locked door to the sewers. Can't get in there yet. Over here is a hover bike. So the hover bike is always moving, and to turn you have to click your mouse, and you can press the V key to uh, boost yourself up. Once you get the hang of it, you can visit the hover duel area to test your skills and earn Corium. Like Moga Attack, we can't actually do the hover bike area, so we have to make you very sure we don't go there. Notice how the hover bike becomes very gray uh, when we run out turbocharge. So this is the hover. That's the hover bike dual area over there. So uh, don't go there because you will lose all your progress. Let's go over here instead. We're in the Institute of Technology. Huh. Hey, I recognize you from this wanted poster. This would prove to anyone that you're no friends of Gorms. Wanted for crimes against Gorm. Wow, he already knows us, huh? Welcome to Gorm's labs, my friend. When he took over Drugal Vin, he created the Red Guards to keep tight security in the lab. You must avoid being spotted by them. The camera system also alerted the guards, so take your time and be extra sneaky while you're inside. Access denied. You need a security card to enter the facility. Alright, well we can't go here yet. Where is the other area that we need to go to? It's around here somewhere. Drugalvin is a very dirty, polluted, industrial type area. Where is the slums? Should be somewhere. Where is it? I think I'd know by now. Usually, I get screwed over by Voga Attack or the uh, by, uh, the the Light Cycle game. And we get here. So where is the cityscape? By the way, how cool is this? I mean, look at this background. It's amazing. I love I love the design of this game. Oh, the monument of knowledge. Yes, this is this is the place we want to be. This knowledge bank is unlocked. To unlock it, you must solve the tile puzzle. All right. That's right. There's a bunch of knowledge banks in here. Okay. Junior Delegator Rumerts, are you exper are you experienced? Maybe. All right, this place goes on forever. So, ooh, Corium, nice. I wonder if I can farm Corium here if I really need it. I wonder if there's any other Corium around here. Can anyone say hyperbolic time chamber? All right, so we have 118. How much does it give me? That gives me three. Wow, just like it says on the box. Okay. Alright, let's play some mini-games. Junior Delegator Spungoki. To access the knowledge banks, you must first solve the tile puzzle. Change all the colors, the tiles to white. To switch a tile's color, walk onto it and press the X key. The color will flip, but so will the tiles to the left and right. Just the tiles to the left and right, by the way, not up and down. Interesting, interesting isn't it? One. So basically, you can do this row by row and just eliminate them as you see fit. Like that. Pretty simple. Alright. Bam, 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 bam. Sometimes it's easier to make them all purple. All right, we've got all of them. Let's see here. Ooh, the security card. Sweet. Did, did we get it or? Yeah, we got it. All right, cool. And then there's this. Our new quest assignment. Gorm has destroyed all of the portals to Elta Siktar, except for one, which is hidden deep inside the sewers of Dredalvin. So we have to get into the sewers. 
Here is a secret only to know those who have reached this spot. When you reach level 5.5, you will unlock an upgrade that will boost all of your stats. This upgrade is important and you need to survive on Elta Sakaar. We are not level 5 yet, so we actually need a little bit of work. So even the grinding I did that seemed kind of tedious... Still, still kind of tough to do. You still need to do more. Now, the game kind of expects you to do a lot. Alright. Your security card checks out. Welcome to Gorm's Institute of Technology. Stay free with Gorm! Oh god, so even though we're in here and we're allowed in here, we actually have a lot of trouble. Uh, we can't go anywhere without getting caught. Hi, I'm trying to create a Zoran antidote and I need your help to get the right chemicals. If you agree to help me, you'll see five colored lights on my mixing vat. Get me five vials that match the colors and bring them here to throw them in the vat. Whatever you do, don't get caught by the guards. Bring back three purple and two green. Okay. So we're gonna help this guy out. Oh, I almost got caught by the camera. Okay. I think I know a code that'll disable on the cameras. Want me to try? So the IT researchers over here, they're on our side. They uh, don't really have any quarrel with us. So they'll let us come and go as we please. Uh, we just kind of throw the vials in here. Bam, like that. This is another area where the camera's scrolling really kind of screws at you. And those are red guards right there. Can't really, don't want to screw with them either. The moment I touch you, it's game over. And all the progress you got with this potion business, it's gone. Shoot, that was close. Hoop, okay. Are the red guards making things tough to you? They'll come to investigate any noises, so try throwing the beakers down the hall as a distraction. Also, don't make sure to walk in front of the cameras. Oh my god, this camera. Okay. There are purple vials in there, so I need to get this. Hoop, okay. Good thing we got points in agility. It actually makes a slight difference. Oh, come on. Alright, so here's the problem. Now that guard's just gonna stand there for a little while. All of the guards are gonna stand there for a little while. I think they go away eventually. I mean, I hope to god they go away eventually, otherwise I'm screwed. Or I have to throw this vial. Okay, we, did, we threw a vial instead, okay. That that sort of kind of worked. That was awesome, in a way. All right. I'll distract the guards for you. Make your move while they're not looking. All right, I guess he's distracting the guards now. I just need some purple vials. Oh, thank God. Please, just de please deactivate the camera. Oh, thank God. Got them all. All right, so we, uh, we got it. All right. I'm working on a brain enhancing potion. We need two purple, two green, and one orange vial. So this guy's a lot of stuff that he can do. We're gonna do all of them, because, well, they're worth it. So we need two purples. Oh god, I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> must be all this, must be all this, this freaking gas coming out of the vials. Why can't I grab it? Oh, I broke it. Oh crap, the guards are gonna come now. It actually might be a good thing, but, uh, jeez, this stuff just really freaks me out sometimes. Grab the vial. Grab the vial. Grab the vial, me. There we go. Oh god. Some of these objects are really badly placed. Alright, that's one green. I might leave and come back to respawn the potions. Alright, after the hard one. Yeah, there's a yellow potion. There's orange potions in here. Wow, they are stuck there, aren't they? That's awesome. Oh crap, that was close. I can open the exit to downtown Dreedal Finn. Would you like me to do that? Heck yes, please. 
Alright, so he's gonna go up and open the sewers for us. Before we do that, though, we're gonna finish his brain potion. Ooh. Alright. Alright, so we just increased our brains. Oh, wow, he's just doing a bunch of different stuff. I wonder what happens at the end of this. I really want to know. Orange, purple, blue, green. Wow, this is gonna be- this is not- this is not doing any, any favors, is it? Oh, wrong- wrong room. Or- wow, I need all the colors and then two orange. Wow, look at that one. Look at that one over there. How are you supposed to get that? Like, how do you- how do you- how do, how do you expect someone to get that? Alright, I need a purple now. I think we're out of purple. Oh, no, there's one more. Where's blue, though? I haven't seen any blue. I haven't seen any blue potions. Also, why can't this guy do them, this himself? Just just wanted to ask, just wondering, why can't he do it himself? Like, isn't that a good question? Why can't he run around and do this stuff? Alright, so this guy unlocked the exit to the sewers, and the other guy unlocked the exit to the... Uh, downtown Dreidel Vin. We're gonna need to use both eventually. Uh, we're gonna go to the downtown Dreidel Vin first because you always go to the town first. All right. Nice. Thank you. Thank you for being on my side, IT IT researcher. Usually the scientists are real big jerks, like in Metal Gear Solid Three. Man, those scientists are worse than actual guards. All right, one more. An elusive blue potion. Where is it? I assume it's in a blue room, considering the way things have been going. Yep, there it is. Right next to all of these guards that can't see me. Thank goodness. I actually might have them all go over here now. Awesome. What else can you make me? An experience boosting potion. That's what I wanted. Okay, I need two blue, two orange, and one green vial. Do I have enough of that? Whoops. Yeah, well, they're all gonna go over there now. The experience boosting potion is probably the... the what, oh, g the experience boosting potion is probably what uh, I'm really after. So it's pretty good that we got that now. Did they just ignore the alarm? Why are they ignoring the alarm? Are, are, why? Are they tethered to that area over there? I think that's the sewer area over there. Yeah, they're just stuck there. Okay, cool. Oh, come on. No, no, they're they're definitely attracted to that area now. Okay. Yeah, they just check that and they go right back to the other area. It's like they get called there and like permanently. That's really cool. I like that a lot. Props to that guy doing the permanent distraction. It might be a glitch, but I don't care. Alright, I'm looking for how many blue potions again? I need two. Gosh darn it. I bet there's some up there that I can't reach because they're all over there. Yeah, I see him. I see one here. Wow, how do you get through this? I'm gonna have to wait for those guys to go away. Okay, good, they're 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 gone. I'm done being assholes. Wow, that guy's really, really freaking out. Okay, we're just gonna set up all the, all the, all the alarms. Alright, now we need to just get one more blue potion, and I swear to Christ, it's gonna be really difficult. I don't even know if it's possible. 
Oh yeah, it's so not possible. So not possible. We're getting out of here. We're gonna leave and come back because I'm, I'm not losing my progress. Right, we're gonna go back in. Here we are again. All right. If he resets his progress, oh, he still need. Oh, he still needs the blue. Okay, cool. We 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 basically reset the entire thing. Awesome. Okay. All right. He's gonna save this camera so I can get out of here safely. All right. So it's good to know that. Whoa. Good to know that we get to keep our potion progress. Now I just need to get the blue potions from up there. Before these assholes come back. Oof, that was close. Alright, one more blue potion. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We're not okay. Suddenly not okay. Crap. Uh. All right, let's try this again. You know what? Let's just have that one guy distract them again. I respawned all the potions, so I don't really need anything. You. I'll make things a little easier to traverse. I think I'll disable this one too while I'm at it. Thank you. I like their design, these guys with the spider heads. Classic. Like, that is such a classic design. Alright, this guy's gonna distract the guards again. Awesome. Okay, now they're all going over there. Whew! Three more to go. This is taking a while, but I'm sure it's worth it. That camera is going crazy. Alright, now for the hard part. Two blues. Got one. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I lost him. I actually lost him. Holy cow, that's awesome. I've never been able to lose someone like that before. If my hypothesis is correct, they'll just go back to their post. Yep. I don't care, 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 I don't care. Oh, we got it. Alright, so this is where we can grind experience if we wanted to. Wow, that's actually a lot of points for experience, holy cow. So you could do that. I don't think I will though, but oh well. Alright, now we are free to bolt it to Drugal Vin's downtown area. Welcome, Traveler. Watch out for Unis watching these dark streets. They're on Gorm's side. To protect yourself, pick up some Artisoid Mist or a containment device from the merchants. Be sure to visit our market during your visit. The merchants have there have something for everyone. Yeah, look at that. We got, we got skylines. Alright, so those are the guys that they were talking about. This thing we picked up here is a containment device. We can use this containment device to 
really sc screw with those guys over there. Oh, hey, it's Skylar the Street Punk. Think you can jump the energy rope without letting it touch your feet? You need all the speed and agility you can get. Alright, let's fight. You beat me, you're really fast. Now you can glitch with me. So, there's a Street Punk male for you. Uh, that's what they look. That's what their uh, body looks like. We've only been able to see their arms so far. All right, that guy down there. That guy works for Gorm. <gasps> this item we have here is a containment device. If I throw this at him, got him. This is an Uni. We can glinch with him if we wanted to. So let's see what he he gives. I gotta say, it's not much. What did that actually increase? Okay, power is this, agility, endurance, speed. Okay, give us a little bit more endurance. I, while I admit he's cool, I definitely don't think it's worth uh, switching out for. You can pick up the containment device again, however, that will cause him to become free and he will probably knock the crap out of you and make you start the area over again. So what we're gonna do... Yeah, just avoid all of these things that are trying to kill you. Alright, let's go and grab another containment device. See who else we can glinch with. Maybe somebody cool looking. Yeah, he looks like he got free of that containment device. He's not very happy at all. Damn, these guys are fast. Holy cow. Yeah, he grabbed the containment device before I could. Yeah, I don't think I'd be- uh, damn, that sucks now. Okay, I didn't- I didn't think he was gonna take that one. A thousand Corium? Holy cow! Uh, Jesus. Access card? Okay, there's a level 5 access card. I guess I'll take that. Uh, that magnetic repulsor really helps. A hover bike upgrade chip. Chip? I don't really need that. Another hover bike upgrade chip. Oh, really? Really, Bounty Hunter? You gonna mess with me right now? Another... This guy is willing to trade the laser cutter for the sweet biker upgrade. I mean, I'll take it because I don't have any more use for the laser cutter. A containment device, 50 corium. Eh. Artisoid mist, nope. Containment device, nope. Elevation device, nice. Ooh, we're ready for the upgrade. Okay, I get it now. This is this is an easy way to get Corium, because I can sell a bunch of my elevation boosters if I wanted to. And I need the magnetic repulsor, so how many do I need? I need about five more. Elevation boosters. Oh god, it's gonna suck. So I need to go all the way back to Arbo and grab five elevation boosters because I can't do any Getting out of here. Getting out of here. Oh god. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're super fast. We're sonic fast. And we're out of here. I got the level one hover bike upgrade too, so we can we can boost a little faster. Not very noticeable, but oh well. Alright, here we are at the Monument of Knowledge. Alright, where's that guy that asks if we're experienced? You've earned an upgrade, do you want it now? And... Bada boom, we now have body armor, I guess. So, and, and it's boosted our species stats. It looks pretty cool. This upgrade will help you through Dredelvin and onto Elta Siktar and Kek. So now we have some battle armor and our stats are greatly increased. That's another way the game lets you helps you out. Alright, so the real problem begins now. We need to uh, go back to Arbo, grab a bunch of elevation boosters. We need to farm elevation boosters.
I never thought I I always had trouble with this one part of getting Corium, and I played the uh, play that coral game with that speedy guy all the time. Like I just did that over and over again. But now that I can get elevation boosters and sell it, that's that's just a load off my shoulders. I'm so happy that we can do this. Grabbed it, guys. All right, so that's one down, four to go. Thank the heavens. I wonder if I can just buy a bunch of them. I don't think I can. I don't think the game allows you to have more than one. No, I don't want to play Taka right, Traka right now. I wonder if Drachmir will sell me more than one of them. I doubt it. Ooh, I can. So if I exit and come back, I can get more. Oh, this is this is awesome. Maybe I can do it more than once. Yes, yes, let it begin. This is great. Like this is seriously awesome. No, I don't want that. I'll just grab as many as I can and sell them for profit. Alright, so I have four boosters, and I have... I have enough for 13 of these. That'll uh, that'll do. I'm, some, I'm completely fine with having that much money. As long as I don't screw anything up. I think there might be one more minigame left that I have to completely avoid. So we'll probably be okay. Like I think we're in smooth sailing now. There is another there is another thing here in which I can get locked in the sewers. I gotta be really careful about that. Last time I tried to play this and record it, I got stuck in the sewer. Like I was really good about avoiding uh bug attack and the light cycle game. Oh my god, I got stuck in the sewer and I was so upset. I just couldn't believe I got stuck. It was maddening. I just, oh my god, so upset. Really glad I don't have to spend money on, uh, I mean, I don't have to grind money out anymore. Okay, seven more. This is awesome. Like, I'm really glad I'm able to, uh... find strategies for beating this game a little faster than normally it would take. And I get to skip all the light cycle. Because you, you can't play light cycle. You, you can't do it. I, I really liked playing it back in the day. Like, I played a lot of light cycle. And it was fun. And I made Corium while I was doing it, too. It might be because it might also be because I'm a really big fan of Tron. I love Tron. And that's a really good franchise. I wish it kept going. Three more. Three more. God, the allergies are killing me down here. Right. Three more. Why didn't I notice this exploit earlier? Probably because I was already so caught up in playing mini games. Alright, we got him. We got all the elevation boosters we can carry. Wow, that's... wow. Like, I saved, like, half an hour. Kinda of funny how our only act, only way into this place is through the Institute of Technology, but whatever. Let's trip this camera. Let's pass the guards. All right, we're in. Sweet. All right, we're in downtown Dreidelvin, and there is. I don't think that's a.
Alright, Rokush is going to unlock the door for me, but I don't trust him. Like, I think that's how I got stuck last time. Alright, let's get a bunch of Corium. How many of these do I have, anyway? This antidote cures anyone frozen by the- Should I go back and, like, cure the Zoran people? Does that work? I feel like I've checked that before, like, it didn't do anything. Like, I feel really obligated to do that now. Like, to go back and check if the Zorans are okay. Like, if I can cure those people. I highly doubt it, but maybe I can try it later. I won't forget about it. I, I won't. Alright, I have... Two more elevation boosters. Nice. I think I'll keep one for myself. Alright, a magnetic repulsor. You're gonna need one if you're heading to the sewers. The only one in Drujalvin. Once charged, press the X key to send a repulse repulse. There's that Oro guy. Where's the bounty hunter? Where's that fat asshole? There he is, freaking out over there. Alright. Not a containment device. Oh, I see, I see. There's two of them. Got one. It's a fat seed. Okay, you got me. What do you want? Oh wow, he's powerful, holy cow. Unfortunately, I don't need his power, so... I'm gonna grab the containment device just in case. Whoa! Ah, oh, he caught me! Crap. And now I just have a bunch of elevators. I need to sell the elevation boosters, leave the map, and come. I need to sell, leave, come back. God dang it. Dang it. How many do I have? I have 11. I need to sell 10. Jesus, God. One. Two, if only I can do this multi. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Got it. Gonna buy that. Gonna leave a map, come back. Okay, there we go. Now we have a little bit of an autosave. Okay, we're in downtown now. So now we're gonna go into the sewers. Oh, not that way. Alright, Rokush. I swear the door Rokush opens, like, doesn't stay open. So, I'm a little skeptical. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that doesn't stay open. Also, that guy is a new guy. I want to see what he does, what he gives. I just need to find a containment device. There's one. Alright, where is he? I need a good view of him before I can attack him. Gotcha! So this is a thin hunter. His name is Slim. Alright, so he's definitely a brainsy kind of guy. Honestly, my stats are pretty good. Yeah, I think I'll take my stuff back. My, like, you can't, like, Street Punk is just so good. Like, brokenly good. Anyway, that thing's open, but I don't trust it. Charm Arena. I guess that's how you unlock the sewers. What's over here? Maybe it's an Endurance Arena. Speed Arena. 
Yeah, I don't need that. I only need endurance now as a stat. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go back to the research facility now. And I'm gonna open up the... Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. No, don't come here. Wow, I can't even escape the city. I like how he goes back to pick up his thing. Alright. So, if I recall, I should be going through the sewers from the research institute instead of where that guy opens it up. Alright, sewer sector 1. Oh, please don't freeze on me. Did you you can't do this to me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why is this game so hard to play? Oh Jesus. No, 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 you can't be serious. I've never done it that way. Oh my god. You know what? Let's continue this another time. I think I'll... I think I need a Galador break. Jeez, I've... Oh my god. I've hit... I've avoided the light bike, but I couldn't avoid Boga attack, and I couldn't avoid Sewer Sector Gosh Darn 1. Holy cow. Oh my god. <laughs> Good night, everybody. I'll see you later.